Hi everyone, how are you today? I hope you are always healthy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you several popular celebrity photos such as Lil Nas X, Justin Bieber, Lady Gaga, Britney Spears, and many more, proving that the one-eyed occult elite is always there for you. Some might say that I'm being repetitive by displaying these image. But that's the whole point. These pics are proof that a small occult elite is controlling thousands of industry of slaves across the world, while owning the media disseminating this symbolism. And lately, the one eye sign is more omnipresent than ever. The phenomenon that I've been observing for years is only amplifying to the point that it is now completely unavoidable. The elite is clearly showcasing its tentacular control of all aspects of society, yet most people stay blind to it all. So, without further ado, fasten your pants and let's get started. Little Nas X spent last year parading around in various dresses. Also, he released a video where he literally grinded on Satan for his young fans to witness. His compliance to the elite's agenda was rewarded. Little Nas X was on GQ's Men of the Year issue, and the cover is pure MK Ultra symbolism. The two Nas X, representing alter personas, combined with a dualistic black and white theme, are monarch symbolism 101. In other words, their men of the year are actually slaves. Before I continue the video, please give a like if you'd learned something. And, don't forget to subscribe, and also, click the notification bell too, so you won't miss any update. And, watch to the end, to avoid misunderstanding. Thank you. As usual, the one eye sign was all over the place last month. And, as usual, it was displayed by the world's biggest stars, on the world's biggest platforms. Here are two facts that you need to know about Canada. One it is the birthplace of Justin Bieber. Two there's a Tim Hortons restaurant every 500 yards. When the two combined for a marketing campaign, this one eye sign was plastered all over the country. Yup, Biebs needs to tell you that he's controlled, even when he's selling donut holes. But wait. Maybe this is not about the one eye sign. Maybe it's just a fun way of showcasing the product. No coincidence. One eye signed, combined with a triple six sign as a bonus. Just more proof that the elite is in full control of Bieber's. <laughs> A couple months ago, I published my first video about Lady Gaga, which explained why she kept doing the one eye sign. And now, she is now something of grand priestess in the industry. But she still has to do the sign. In this photo shoot of The Hollywood Reporter, Lady Gaga's headpiece creates an also clever one eye sign. In my video about Squid Game, I explained how it symbolically celebrated the sickness of the occult elite. You better believe that the stars of this series will be used to keep promoting that sickness. Why Ha Joon played the role of the police officer in Squid Game? In a photo shoot for Days Korea, he uses a mask, representing an alter persona in MK Ultra, to make the one eye sign. In another pic, he makes another one eye sign. Also, he wears a prominent butterfly board. Monarch programming. The cult elite couple, Chrissy Teigen and John Legend, recently threw a massive Squid Game themed party. Chrissy was disguised as the red light green lie girl that got a bunch of people killed, and John Legend played the role of the degenerate VIP, who paid to watch people die and wanted to abuse a server. They even recreated the Masonic checkboard pattern floor, which symbolically represented a ritual sacrifice in the series. In Squid Game, poor people fraud each other for money. The elite finds that very amusing. They've also recreated that scene. At the 2021 AMAs, Cardi B wore a creepy gold mask with eye-shaped earrings with creepy fingers hanging off them. She also wore yellow contact lenses and a black veil, which are usually worn at funerals. In short, pure cult elite sickness. 
Furthermore, there's a growing trend of celebrities wearing dehumanizing masks. In a disturbing photo shoot for V Magazine, Madonna posed in a picture, recreating Marilyn Monroe's death scene. This is the actual death scene. As explained in previous videos, the occult elite sees Monroe as a prototype of the industry slave. Every female celebrity in the Beta Kitten system must channel her. And now, they go as far as celebrating her bizarre and untimely death which could have been a sacrifice. Speaking of industry slaves, Britney Spears is the most obvious modern-day example. Although she's been recently released from her father's conservatorship, she's most likely still a slave, with a new handler. Her constantly upsetting Instagram account is proof of this fact. Pics on Britney's Instagram account showed her laying on the ground and bloody. She is wearing handcuffs with feline prints, a reference to beta programming. In short, this is yet another picture of her that screams out industry slave. She's not free at all. As a member of One Direction, Harry Styles was extremely popular with children and teenagers. Partly because of that, he was chosen to push the all-important agenda. His most photo shoot for Days magazine is pure elite sickness symbolism. On the picture used for the cover, there's a special emphasis on his butterfly tattoo, a reference to monarch mind control. The rest of the photo shoot is all about the soul deadening, cost of being a slave of the industry. The photo shoot contains about 10 pictures such as this one. Harry Styles is clearly in the phase of his career. Speaking of what is happening with Kid Cootie? He wore a bridal dress at the CFDA Fashion Awards, and, judging by his face, he was not happy with this. Honestly, he looks like he was abused just before putting on that thing. By the way, two months ago, Cootie was walking around at the Met Gala looking like this. Comment below with more topic ideas for me to discuss. As a lot of care and hard work goes into this, likes and subscribe, let me know I'm doing a good job. All is appreciated greatly. You may not agree with everything from the content I post. Apply critical thinking and use discernment to come to your own conclusions regarding the content. Thanks for watching this video. This Everything Inside Me channel, see you on the next video. Stay safe and healthy.